when the going gets really tough and you can't even see and you're working totally by feel, you're just gonna rip them off and rest in peace your fingers. boys five miles an hour literally like zero what is going on guys I hope you all are having a fantastic day and I'm coming back at you with another video today and it's a quick one we're filming here right before it gets dark and I wanted to talk about what are the best gloves for working on your car now there's a lot of people who think oh you got to wear gloves every time you work on your car that is not my experience my experience is most jobs you're in a place, it's way too tight for gloves, you just don't have the dexterity, so you rip them off and you don't wear the gloves anyway. So what's the point in wearing gloves when you're doing something like, you know, you're trying to get to that broken off bolt and you just can't get to it, so you end up tearing off the gloves and your hands get a mess anyway. Really, when you're working on a car, the only thing that I wear gloves for, and this is just me, I'm not talking about everybody, the only thing that I wear gloves for is doing suspension work and I might wear a set of nitro gloves while I'm doing an oil change or something like that obviously. So let's get into talking about these gloves in specific. They are Impact by Mechanics, mechanics.com, right on them. I have nothing to do with them. They did not pay me or anything for this video. I just really like these gloves. I actually originally bought the gloves not even for doing mechanics work. I bought them because I thought that they looked cool, genius that I was. And I used them originally for mountain biking, which they work extremely well for. This rubber overmold protected my pinky finger when I was riding, and I'm embarrassed to say this, my handlebar smashed into a tree. Pinky was there, rubber overmold kept them safe. But the rubber overmold has way more than just protecting your fingers from trees when you are mountain biking like an idiot. It will protect your fingers when you are pushing as hard as you can on a ratchet and all of a sudden either the socket breaks, the ratchet breaks, or the bolt is loose or broke, either one. But there's nothing worse than working really hard and then just absolutely destroying your hands. So that's why these are good to wear when you're doing suspension work. They have nice little like, I don't know what these are, they're like gel pad inserts. You can hit stuff with your palms. And they got a nice, it's almost like a composite plasticky material across this. And that's really nice for if you're pulling cable or something like that. If there's ever a wire hanging out that will rip you right open, that little bit extra protection there. These gloves have surprisingly good dexterity for being their most heavy duty line of glove, I guess you would call it. You can get in and turn bolts and stuff like that. Now, obviously, when the going gets really tough and you can't even see and you're working totally by feel, you're just going to rip them off and rest in peace your fingers. You know, that's what it is. But when you have the space and, and everything's great, which it never is, these gloves work really, really, really well. I recommend getting a size that is too small in the store because they will stretch and break in. I believe these are medium. I do not have small hands. They work awesome. They're not waterproof by any means. I tried them in the snow. They got all wet. Don't do that. They're not fireproof by any means. I tried moving a burning log. Don't do that. Yeah guys, in general, if you need good gloves for working on your car, this is just my experience. Tell me what gloves you guys use and when you use them, more importantly. and. Uh, yeah, hit me up, like the video, comment it, subscribe to the channel for more truck and uh, general automotive videos. I will see you on the next video. Ooh, guys, check this out. I've caught one. It's another Cummins that is actually used for work. Look at that. Oh my gosh, what a rare sighting this has been here today, ladies and gentlemen just fantastic to see one out in the wild doing work.